Right guys, have a listen. Seriously, that's not me turning anything down. That is complete silence. You are watching Sport Boys TV. Welcome to the channel. And this vlog is awesome because it ends here. Enjoy. Hello and welcome back to the channel. So this one, um, I don't really know how it's gonna go because I plan on walking up to that and then I'm gonna walk over there and just see what's on that corner. Yes, a little bit of exploration. Um, I've just did the vlog what I've walked upon landed up here. If you haven't seen that, um, it's in the description. Go check it out. Um, so yeah, I think, I think just past the hotel, um, there is a like a little kind of walkway going up and I think it leads onto these this walkway here um, Yeah, so I'm pretty unfit and this is gonna suck, but I'm guessing the views up there are gonna be pretty spectacular Wow, would you look at that? So yeah, so I think the path is up there Not sure but There is only one way to find out and that is by going and explore You'll never know if you don't go. You'll never know if you don't go. <laughs> don't know what about. And just in case you have been living in a cave, I'm currently in Landon now. And this is the amazing view which is bestowed upon me. Is that the right word? I'm not sure. It just sounds cool. So I just spent about 20 minutes playing uh, those grabbing machines for Logan. I managed to win him a Deadpool. So this is the path. You've got a path that goes up here. Oh, we've got the road. Now I'm thinking of going up the road just to see where the road goes. But have a look at this. It's like all proper, like built into the rock. Look. Now we had a look in here the other day. It's quite spooky. But just in case you haven't seen that vlog, we're going to have another look. Ugh. Hiya, mate. So this is pretty cool. It's all like carved into the rock. Some sort of, it's like I'm in Gondor. Oh God. Open air Sunday worship. Hmm, interesting. Hiya. Yeah. Where does this lead? If happy I... Valley. So happy it's... Valley? Yeah, it's just like a big field. Like... Is it very happy? Yeah. Is it gonna make me happy? Yeah. What about this? Which is the best way? Best view? Was it the same? I'm gonna go there. Oh, nice. Yeah. So it should be easy. <laughs> be <bad. laughs> ah. She said I should be fine. Obviously, she doesn't know me. <laughs> um. So yeah. So from this point out, expect a lot of heavy breathing. <laughs> Hopefully the camera don't pick up on it though. But it don't look too bad. But look, I can perv on people. <laughs> but we're not gonna be doing that today. Onward, Ooh. back beast. It's the Nazgul. <laughs> Happy Valley, apparently. <clears throat> and I'm wondering my, <laughs> I'm wondering why my hay fever's kicking up so bad. It's because I keep smelling all the bloody flowers. Hmm. Which way to go? Down or up? Hey, the views up here is pretty cool. Are you on the moon? Are you on the moon trapped in the woods? Oh, that's kind of spooky. Oh, we're going this way. The view up here is amazing, mind. Wow! Would you look at that? I wonder why it's called 
Happy Valley. Could it be because these kind of views make you happy? Because it's making me happy. But what's not making me happy is walking up steps. Now we're just down the point. Oh, the hotel's gone. <laughs> I just down a point in that uh, in the hotel, and this is what I'm faced with. That's cheating. When I was standing over there, there the stairs look that go down, and there's like a little cave over there. We could explore that maybe. Oh, this is amazing. I kind of wish I brought my phone so I'd take a picture. But I didn't. Hmm. Sherbid. Sherbid. Kabul. Basically, I need to go see it. Oh, I need to go check that to see if it has any um, weight limit. Because <laughs> I want to go up on the, uh, the cable car, which goes all the way to the top of there. And I think it'll be a lot of fun. This must be Happy Valley. It don't look very happy to me, it looks quite sad. Because there's no one here. I suppose on a nice hot summer's day, this could be different. On a hot summer's day, this could be the happiest valley in the world. But at the minute, it's kind of sad valley. <laughs> oh God. Right. Let us walk up these steps and be very and out of breath in front of these females. <laughs> Don't worry about me and my out of breathness. Have a look at this amazing view. Oh, so it's actually better than I thought it was going to be. Spoiled by a motorbike. So this is the. Uh, so this is. The cable cart. It costs twelve pound fifty for a return. Child is tenner. Family thirty five fifty. Two adults, two children. That's not for us. Uh, nothing about weight limit. This just gives you a the longest passenger cable car in Britain. It's pretty cool. So you start here and you go all the way up. You can't really see anything from here. So you can't really see anything from where I am. But the cable car, look, goes all the way up. Up into the yonder. There we go. How cool is that? Should we go check out Happy Valley? Oh wow. It's pretty amazing up here, mind. Look at that. Awesome. Hello. Hi. Taking some good pictures? <laughs> Where are you from? Uh, Cardiff. You're from Cardiff? Yeah. Nice. I'm from Cardiff. Oh. <laughs> from a place called Lam Rumney. Oh. Do you know Lam Rumney? No. <laughs> are you students from Cardiff just yeah. visiting? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Were you, are you from Japan? No, China. China. Ah, China. Yeah. Mihao? Yeah. 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 <laughs> what does that mean? Is that hello? Yeah. yeah. Do you know what hello is in Welsh? Yeah. Borida. Borida. Well, Borida. Oh, okay. Anyway, guys, you catch you later. Mihao. <laughs> so this must be Happy Valley. Very quiet. Some motorbike hits over there. 
It's a little park for uh, about eight children to play in. What's over here? Now I did say that I'm gonna attempt to walk to the corner just to see what's there. As I've had the camera facing that way for a bit, I thought I'd have a feast on my face for a bit. We're gonna go check out what's here. Got a little bit of information as you can see. And then it's got some sort of memorial uh, bell thing. So let's go and check out the bell in Landitno's happiest valley in all of Landitno. I don't know what I'm talking about. This is one impressive looking lamp. <laughs> Hello lamp. Talking about Happy Valley. Now it's too dark and I can't read it. But it's basically a map telling you things about the Happy Valley. And we got some sort of cool stuff in Welsh. <laughs> right. Get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Get the hell out of here. <laughs> so this is the bandstand. Now a lot of the things in Land Didno have a um, Alice in Wonderland theme. Because apparently the person who wrote Alice in Wonderland um, wrote it here or something. Or he's from here. So all over the place you're gonna have little things like um there's a mad hatter on the front um you've got things like this look it's to celebrate the uh the person who wrote it now i don't know who wrote it so ain't i a bad boy but i don't research these things you've got landed nose version of stonehenge which there was a little bit of information on it by there but unfortunately it was too dark for me to read otherwise um, I would have read it. So, what's this? Oh, that could be cool. Cool shot. In the, uh, in the light. I think it's Queen Victoria. Did she turn, was she here, was she? That's Queen Victoria. It's quite spooky, to be honest. But it doesn't have anything else. Or is that the Queen from Alice in Wonderland? I'm not quite sure. I don't know. Oh, you're on me. So now, um, we're gonna attempt to walk to the corner. Now I've gotta be careful, because I think a lot of cars go nuts down there. So, yeah. where can all you go from? So before we venture off that way, we're gonna sit down for two minutes and just embrace the beauty of the sunset. Ah, yeah. The benches are not too bad in Landidno. But what is not too bad is this. This amazing, awesome view. I was going to say, can you hear a car? Where's a car? There's a road underneath me. Now, I kind of want to go that way, but I'm not sure if it's safe. But, uh, if you're new here, my name is Mike, you are watching the Spud Boys TV. Uh, I basically go around vlogging my life, putting it on the internet and hoping that people are going to like it. Silence! <laughs> um, if you're not new here, hey guys, what's happening? It's me and it's another vlog from me. Um, currently in Land Didno, if you already don't know. Check out the past videos, because the last couple of videos I've uploaded um, I tell you what, all the videos I upload from Landon know it'll be in the playlist, uh, just where they are, so you can go down and backtrack. Um, they're all going to be in my playlist, because I have my own playlist, Mikey's, Mike's Vlogs, Mikey's Vlogs. Um, so go check it out, you know, because all of the playlists will be chronological, chronological order, so you can go back and watch whatever you want, when you want, and embrace the beauty of me and my vlogging style. But Mike, enough yapping! You told us you're going to go this way, and that's what they're going to do. You don't want me sitting here yapping about life and stuff, talking about how amazing I think every single one of you who are watching this vlog are. 
if that makes any sense and how how much I appreciate your help and support and your comments and and everything I just love everyone that watches the videos even the person who dislikes them because there's one person who some re for some reason goes through the videos and dislikes them maybe they dislike me that's cool I don't mind talk to me in the comments why do you dislike me is it because I am sexy and you are jealous of my sexiness <laughs> okay we are now approaching some sort of guard base some sort of gate now the lights are on but I'm gonna go see what it is I hope it's not someone's house and I'm randomly going into someone's house and like hiya mate I hope that it is something worth what's that guy doing oh god he's not masturbating is he that can't be someone's house looks like a castle this person lives in a castle bloody is as well it's pretty cool isn't it? right the great orm ah good it's a path last thing i want to be doing is walking up here well, there's no path i want to go down here but it's gated unfortunately I made right? Did I scare you? Sorry. What's this way? Do you know? What's that, yeah? Do you know what's this way? It goes... Is it worth walking up there? It goes all the way around the house, doesn't it? And it comes back down either side. I said in my vlog, I was standing down there and I was like, I'm going to walk up here and go to the, the corner just to yeah, show what's over there. It goes right up to the mainland. Like the That's the plan. Right Oh, I don't know if it's dangerous, see, because it's not very lit. <laughs> and I'm not wearing the best of colours, and we're all black. Anyway, take care, buddy. Oh, wow, look at that. She just looks amazing. Now, I don't know how dark this is on the camera, but we are going to continue. Oh, this thing's a shit. This thing's a human shit. <laughs> hey, man, did you take a poop? <laughs> yeah, so I'm literally just going to go to that corner, just to see what's on the other side. Now there's a person in black there, which is uh, it's warning, to be honest. What if it's a giant cow and it's gonna kick me in the head? What if it's a serial killer? Oh God, what am I doing? There you go, that's a warning to tell him that I'm coming. <laughs> it's weird, if I have a wave. Keep on, I keep on having these waves. Like one minute everything's fine, then I just have this wave of like warm, warm, like a warm stench. Oh god, this is dodgy as fuck. <sighs> what am I doing for you guys? Why do I do this to myself? Let's nice, keep watching. Are you mate, right? No, not again. <laughs> What's that? Two nights running. Running? I won't have been after the bus, you know. Ah, uh, fish are you? Nice evening, isn't it? It's amazing. I'm gonna go to the corner and just see what's there. Yeah. This is pretty cool. I don't think I've ever walked next to a. Uh, <laughs> I've never done this before. Right. Which is really cool. You can, you can, there's a path right round, right round if you wanted to, you know. And I could just walk all the way round. Yeah. Right round to. Uh, is it so sure? Is it is it pretty safe if I go around? Or is it, is it quite dangerous? It's a long, long way. No, it's, it's all right. On the path, it's like this, you know. Ah, okay. But it's, uh, yeah, it's a good walk, yeah. Yeah, I might do it. I might do it. I said to myself, I'm going to walk to the corner, but yeah. if I get to the corner, I might go a little bit further. Just see how you go, yeah. Yeah. Walk, you know, right? Yeah, that's all right. Good, though, yeah. I've got big, strong legs. Yeah, it's, like this. <laughs> it's amazing. You take care, my friend. Yeah. Ah, see? He was lovely. And there's you guys thinking the worst. Only problem is, it's dark. And the problem is, how much battery I got? I got enough. So this vlog has actually turned in, I'm enjoying this. This is good, it's a nice walk, everyone's asleep. Only problem is, I don't know if you can see this, uh, this massive rock here, apparently there's a sign there that says uh, falling debris. And that's what, oh, there's a cave there. Do we just, do we have a look? 
Oh, I want a light. Oh man, I want to go in the cave. Just as she was in the cave. I can't be going in there with no torch. There could be a, uh, a bear in there or something. A giant Welsh bear. <laughs> Ready to kiss me on my cheek. Do you know what? This It feels really weird. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know if you guys can see this. This feels so... It looks like it's like slanted. It feels really weird standing here. Next to this giant rock. Oh look. Warning of falling debris. That's not what we want. Please take your litter home. What? Where does that cave go? Oh, it's pitch black. You guys can't see anything. Okay, we'll come back. So, I should have brought a torch. This is amazing. It feels really weird walking next to this. It's like a sheer massive rock. Look at it. I don't know if you can see it. It just feels, oh. Oh man, I feel a bit sick. I you guys can see that. See, I don't know how dark it is on the bloody screen. Oh God, what's on there? Another path there, look. Leading down into the dangerous dungeon. Could you imagine, right? If there was some sort of earthquake and all these rocks just start falling down, I would be completely fucked. There would be no chance of me surviving that. Look, there's massive boulders where they've fallen down. Oh, please don't let anything fall on me. I should be okay by here, surely. I could dodge out the way. This is so good. There's no one here. Speak of the devil, and he shall appear. It's a car coming down here now. Um, should be able to see. Oh, someone just hit me a leg. Uh, you should be able to see it coming from behind me. That's two. Maybe it's the police coming to arrest me. But this is amazing. Hi, mate. Where's mate? He's going slow, that one. This is currently what I'm looking at. It's currently what I'm dealing with. Ha! It's a hard job, this, isn't it? Being a YouTuber. It's hard, isn't it? It's just the curiosity from standing down there and thinking, oh, I wonder what's over there. And now I'm at the corner almost as you can see um, and then we're gonna turn around then and go back because I gotta upload all this footage plus um, I'm up at 7 again tomorrow because tomorrow we're going to Chester which is gonna be pretty pretty cool seriously being a youtuber is the best job in the world one because I get to do amazing things like this. My curiosity, and it was really dark, you can just see my outline. My curiosity takes me to places I never thought I would go. And two, I get to meet the best people in the world. You guys are amazing. The people who watch these vlogs, the people, sorry, I'll do that so you can at least see something. The people who come to these vlogs, you know, they come and watch my vlogs because I help them or I cheer them up or, you know, I somehow inspire people. Um, because I, if you didn't already know, I quit my job. Um, I've had loads of jobs. I've worked in KFC. I worked in Game Station. I worked in Millets. Um, I worked in the cinema. I worked in Ladbrokes and I worked in McDonald's, right? McDon Ladbrokes was the last straw for me. Um, I actually left the Ladbrokes to work at McDonald's. And then from McDonald's, I was like, you know what? I need to follow my passion. I need to, I need to be a YouTuber. Three years later, here I am. I am making a vlog here, which is absolutely amazing and mind blowing. Otherwise, I'll be down there asleep. 
or I don't know what I would be doing. I don't know if I'd be vlogging. You know, I'd be I'd be down there enjoying myself, don't get me wrong. There's nothing wrong with not vlogging. It's just when you do vlog, you push yourself. Personally, I push myself to these limits of wanting to make good content. Not just for for you, but for Logan. Like when Logan's older, when he's like 30 years old, he can look back at all my vlogs and be like, that's my dad. I wish my dad made vlogs when he was my age, so I can watch to see what he was like, see how he dealt with certain situations, you know? But yeah, it is the best job in the world. And thank you so much for literally everything. If it wasn't for you guys watching the content, liking the comments, messaging me, talking to me, you know, a lot of you are now my Facebook friends, you know, I wouldn't be doing this. I wouldn't. But I've always said, I've always said, like, if I may, if I, because I, I do work hard making these vlogs for you guys. Um, in terms of, like, the preparation, the edit, you know, or everything. And even if I had one viewer, one person watched our vlog, and they messaged, they put a comment, and they were like, Mike, I loved your vlog. It helped me get through a shit day. My job is completed. I could have a thousand negative comments. That one positive comment I would focus on. Because to me, someone who's a troll and maybe my vlogs are shit, you know. I'm trying. At least I'm at least I'm trying, innit? At least I'm making something, at least I'm doing it. At least I'm out right now <laughs> risking my life in the middle of fucking nowhere doing a vlog. You know, at least I'm trying to do it. And even if I don't, and even if it is crap, I'll come back and make it better. I know I should have brought a light, because all you're seeing is a silhouette. So please don't shut off, because we're almost at the end of the vlog. But yeah, it's the positive. You always focus on the positive. Yeah, negative feedback and negative criticism is always good. But the positive. That one person who, who like Mike, loved your vlog. Well done, mate. Keep going. You, the people who write that, this vlog is for you, you know? These vlogs are for you. And over the last three years, you know, there's been more of you. There's been more regular people coming into, coming into light. And every single person is welcome. And I will welcome everyone, you know? Everyone is awesome. And I love you all. So, so yeah. So, by this point, by the time this vlog has come out... It would have gone the three years. We would, have, we would have had the three year anniversary. And it's not going it's not going any slower. If anything, it's gonna get better and it's gonna get faster. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. And I am so sorry you can't see me. But check this out. I am at the corner. Oh and somebody's put a chair there for me. So that's where we were. Can't see my hand. And this. Oh man. This is. I am literally blown away how amazing this is. I'm so glad I did this. I wasn't gonna do it. I was like, oh, do you know what? I think I'll I'll do another Streets of Land Dino tour. No one wants to see that. Can you guys see this? There's like a massive line in the water. You know what that is, don't you guys? Godzilla! Godzilla! Ooh. Oh, I can't see it. It says pen to win. Oh, wow. I'm going to sit here for five minutes. So I've hit the corner. Um, it would suck if there was an earthquake now. But this is absolutely amazing. I am so amazed. I wonder if I can go round. Well, should I just keep going? Obviously, I'm not going to keep you guys vlog. I'm not going to vlog because I've kept you here long enough. But I've enjoyed this vlog. Have you enjoyed this vlog? If you have enjoyed this vlog, like the vlog and let me know in the comments if this was a good one. Because personally, this is just obviously the sun's setting over there. You imagine getting here with the sun setting, and if those clouds weren't there. 
this is amazing. I keep saying it because it is. Obviously the camera don't do it justice, but there's there's literally something in there. Godzilla! There's no one here. I'm like the only one here. I'll just check by you. I'll just check by you. I won't keep you long. I'll I'll cut here, but because I've been going for ages. I'm just gonna see if, if it's worth going that way. Or if I just go back. I just did my I just did my intro. <laughs> so I wanna say thank you so much. I'm not gonna go that way, it looks like it goes wrong for ages. I just wanna say thank you so much for watching the vlog. You guys mean the absolute world to me. So this is me signing off from this amazing inspirational view. I would probably start crying if I was a little bit more drunk. Because it is literally silent. There's nothing. You can't hear anything. Look, listen. Apart from that. <laughs> I'm gobsmacked. It would be terrifying if there was a massive roar or a massive like thing come out of the sea. But that's my imagination being crazy. So thank you so much for watching this vlog, guys. I'm not crying. Um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. I've got to walk all the way bloody back now. <laughs>